Hello friends, welcome to another video. My name is Elizabeth and I share here all things health, wellness, and organizing. So today we're gonna do a plan with me. I'm a little nervous, I'm not gonna lie. So this is last week's spread and I am gonna learn from it. I have never done spreads for with stickers for planning ever, ever before. I've always just bought functional stickers and planned out my year. So what I would do when my Erin Condren or any planner for that matter would arrive, I would put in garbage day for all the Fridays for the whole year. So my planner would instantly bulk up, but I knew that I didn't have to like think every week and plan it out. So this year I decided to try it and give it a go to plan the way I see other people plan and do it week by week. And what I'm discovering is that there's joy to planning. I'm a, definitely a sticker person. I love highlighters. I love all the planning stuff. But if I plan it all out for the year, then it's over. And if I just take some time once a week to plan out my week, I can enjoy the process, make it pretty, think about it. So the difference between my first week in the planner and my second week is I'm not gonna be tracking routines as much because I'm getting another planner, if I haven't already shared with you guys before, or already. I ordered the Daily Duo from Erin Condren so that I could track my workout, my AM routine, my PM routine. I am going to keep cleaning in here because that's something that isn't necessarily a routine, even though it is, but it's more so of a task that has to get done than a routine. Like each day there's something that I wanna do and I feel like that should go in the main calendar. So. Um, I'm going to do it a little bit different. I'm also going to keep dinners in for next week. And when you're seeing this, it'll probably be live after next week is over. But I asked on Instagram, you guys wanted to see a plan with me. So here we go. All right. I will get better as we go on, hopefully. Um, I picked for my very first week in my Erin Condren, my favorite kit from Planner Kate. And I'm planning on using Planner Kate primarily in my planner for the whole year. Um, for my weekly spreads. So with the duo, I'm gonna be ordering from all different shops. And for the monthly kits, I'll be doing different shops. But for the weekly, I kind of want it to be uniform and we'll see how this goes. I've heard from other girls is that they get better over time. I will link everything I'm using in the comments, or not comments, in the description box below. Also, if I have any coupons or discount codes, I'll give you those two that I found because um, I'm all about saving money. And I know I have a $10 off Erin Condren code. And if you use it for your first time ordering, you get $10 off and I do as well. So this is what next week's looking like. And it totally stresses me out. Normally, I would just write everything in. And my old style was a friction erasable pen. But I have to tell you, making this spread brought me so much joy. And because it's all from one shop, it's uniform and it's beautiful. And it's not, it doesn't look like disjointed, like something's not supposed to be there because it's all pretty much from one shop. So that's my reasoning, that's my thought process behind it. Um, I don't know, I asked you guys if you wanted to see it and you did, so we'll just see how this goes. Be sure to give this a video a thumbs up and let me know if you do like these kinds of videos in the comment section below. And let me know what kind of planner you're using and are you a sticker girl or not? I've only, I used to only be like a functional sticker girl, like I would buy like just the Band-Aids and just ease for my son, Ethan. But this is a whole new realm that I'm jumping into and I'm doing a lot of talking. So let's just jump in. We're gonna start off with um, a kit I have over here on the other side of my desk. This is Planner Kate kit, MK233C. It's also known as Lush, <laughs> is what I think it's called on her site. And I ordered it because of the washi is like beyond pretty. And it's this pink color and teal and blues, and it's just so pretty for summer. I ordered the sampler. I also wasn't sure, because I'm still new at this, what other kits or what other pieces I'm going am I going to need. So one thing that I did is I ordered the headers, so you can do the headers for the week, so those are all uniform. And then I also ordered thin washi, because thin washi I think is my favorite thing to accessorize with ever in these planners. 
And then I also got this one, which has another piece of washi, more appointment labels. This is called the Hourly 233E. So these are all MK233, and then each one has a different letter. So if you're you know overwhelmed with sticker shopping, I bought um, a whole kit for each week in July. So this is MK233C. I bought E, P, and N-1. So if that helps you in any way. All right, I don't really know how we're gonna do this. I may speed it up and put some music. I may just chat with you guys. We'll just see how it goes. I also um, learned from Laura um, with um, her channel, I'll link it down below, of pulling some of the stickers that I planned on using and putting them on a separate sheet on the side so I'm not flipping through the sticker book throughout the whole video. Since this is my first plan, official plan with me, I figured that might be a good idea so that I'm not stressed going back and forth. So I have to tell you, this is definitely a new way of planning for me. I, uh, I feel like with the quarantine and all that's going on in the world, this has been something I have been looking forward to. And because it's once a week, I've found myself every day looking forward to when am I gonna do the next week. And that's why I think the duo is gonna be really fun because every day I can plan out the next day. And I already do that anyway. Like when I'm laying in bed at night, I'll make a list for the next day. And what I'm excited about is I'll be able to do that in my planner make the list and get ready for the next week. Um, my very first time doing this last week, I thought I was gonna have a heart attack trying to decorate. I thought it was so stressful. So, so stressful, because I didn't wanna do it wrong, but I think what I've learned from all the girls who do this regularly is you kind of find your groove eventually. Pretty. All right, we got the headers down. <laughs> One thing down. Okay, I felt like I didn't have room last week to add the weather, and that's something I wanted to do every day. So we are going to do the thick washi at the bottom. pretty summary sticker to cover up the calendar because we don't need to see that to be honest. Oh, it's starting to come together. It's starting to come together.
right, so Ethan has tennis at nine. On Monday. And I ordered these from Planner Kate in the color I wanted and in the like the letter. So that way I can mark off that this is for Ethan. Not everybody else has tennis and it's at nine. And he has tennis. He just started tennis lessons last week and he loves it, which means I love it because he's nine and he is very busy. All right, and I'm gonna use the same sticker over here on Thursday. I have to tell you, using a kit has made a world of difference because everything is uniform. It all looks beautiful and matches. All right, starting to come together. <laughs> so let's just do this one here. And that's with Beachbody. So we have a corporate call every week. And then I'm gonna be having a, we're starting our new 90s challenge, a fitness challenge in my group. I'm gonna be having a live call at noon. So I think I'm gonna use this one where I can show off the time. Cause it's really important. I don't miss that since I'm leading the call for this one. So 12 and I'm gonna be doing um, our Rise of Nation 90s call for our girls. So we're doing a 90s theme, so that'll be fun. All right, so that looks like it's for Monday. Now let's move to Tuesday. I have um, meetings at church, which will be at nine until noon. So, oops, I don't wanna lose that. Okay, so I think I'm going to use this one here for nine. I have a nine o'clock meeting and an 11 o'clock meeting. So I'm gonna write meeting here. And I feel like I need <laughs> my ruler for this so that I don't make a mess. So till 1230. I have some arrow stickers coming from Planner Kate and I'm looking forward to using them so I can put them here too. So I have meetings here. Um, and then Wednesday, so I know Planner Kate is having releases, new releases for her like monthly spread for September. So I have a sticker I wanna do and I think I'm gonna put this right at noon because I'm not sure what time of day, but I did have this sticker in the sampler and I know she sells this on its own, but I'm gonna put this here and I'm gonna put releases. Because I wanna order my September stickers. Okay. All right, so Wednesday night we're having a movie night at church, which is gonna be really fun on the big screen. So I have a movie night sticker. This is from a sticker book from Michaels. Um, and then I also have these big ones. I wonder if that would fit on there. That'd be kind of cute to do it on a big, 
big sticker because the movie's gonna be over a few hours, you know, a couple hours, and it's gonna be on the big screen and we're gonna have popcorn and drive in with our cars. So I'm gonna put this here. Oh, that's perfect. Love that. Okay, movie night, and then I'm gonna, I've got a church sticker. I have all the stickers. I'll just put it above it. Church movie night. All right, we're coming together. The only thing is, is I was planning on doing dinner in the five o'clock hour, but I'll probably put it in the four o'clock hour, even though we're not gonna eat at four, we're gonna eat at five. Unless I put church down here, then I could still use the five o'clock hour. That might work better. Work in progress, guys, work in progress. I'm figuring it out. Okay, church movie night. All right, we'll do dinners in a minute, but how pretty is this coming together? I'm loving it. I'm still thinking I may do the thin washi, but I just don't want it to be too crazy. Figuring out the style. Okay, um, I have church on Sunday. I think I forgot another one of my stickers. I need an alarm clock because I always forget, always forget. All right, and it looks like there's a lot of coral and teal in the spread, so I'm gonna grab an alarm clock and coral. So I have some employees that are under me that I turn in their hours for, for payroll each week, and so I need to make sure I put the alarm clock on so that I remember to turn in their hours because I always forget. Okay, so let's do church is on Sunday. How did I do it last week? Let's take a little look and see. Okay, I put it on here and then just did a line. Simple enough, we can do that. So I have to be there at, these are coming off, right here. And we're gonna do it's actually like 8.45, I have to be there 8.30. And then we're gonna do till like one o'clock. Love it, okay. And then I need to do a reminder because I always forget that time cards need to be turned in. <laughs> so I'm gonna do one of these bright coral flags here and do it at 1.30, so like when we're leaving, that's it straight, that I will turn in the time cards for my people. I think I skipped like the whole week and I went right to Sunday. But one of the things that I like to do, which may sound silly, but it really works, is I try to fill up the car with gas on Sunday so that we don't run out <laughs> of gas anywhere. And there's certain gas stations that I like more than others. And I just don't wanna be in like a bad part of town when I need to fill up on gas. So I like to try to make sure we fill up on gas on Sundays. That's what I try to do, it doesn't always happen. Okay, Saturday, I think the only thing we have happening or that I have happening is I do a weekly workout with my girl squad. So our fit squad, we all work out on our own times and then just join in for accountability um, into our group, which is lots of fun. So like this month is gonna be, is all 90s themed, like the era of the 90s. And so, this Saturday, we do a live workout at 10 on Zoom. And I love these stickers, the Zoom workouts. So I've got that there. Um, Thursday is payday with Beachbody. So every Thursday, uh, people can rank advance and then also it's payday. I'm trying to get the sticker off. 
So I like to put that at the top, but then I can't do the weather. Where am I going to do the weather this week? Cause that was the problem last week. Okay, I'm gonna do pay bill because our money is due for our trip. We're going on a trip, if we can, for our success club. So for helping people on their fitness journey, you get to go on free trips, but I have a deposit that's due on Friday. Okay, one thing that I'm doing is instead of putting a fork and knife for every single day, I'm just doing it at the beginning of the spread because I know that's gonna be dinners. I also did a color last week for this and I didn't like how it popped um, the coral color. So I think I'm gonna do just the pen. The other thing is, is I think I'm not gonna do the thin washi at the top. I think I like this separate, just washi at the bottom. All right, a couple other things I need to add. Mondays, we go to the library in the afternoon after my call. So I'll put that at one o'clock. And um, Thursday is our beach day. So we try to go to the beach once a week. We live about half an hour, so I always put that in. And then Friday, we go to the park. So on the days that we're not doing something like this, we try to go to the pool. So something to keep the kids busy and something they know they can expect each day. All right, so I'm gonna definitely take time to plan next, or the following week, I guess. Um, and I'll probably block off a little bit of time here so that I can plan it. And then I have our cleaning schedule. That's the last thing I kind of need to enter in here. And I wish you could see my desk. It's a disaster now. Everything is everywhere. <laughs> um, and I'm going to do, I'm going to try this and see if we do Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. I know I've seen stickers that have that listed and I'm pretty sure I don't have that. Let me go see if I do. So I thought this was recording. So I would just put the laundry sticker here and then I've got laundry for Monday, surfaces for Tuesday. So my stickers are way too big. They're the size of two boxes for each. So I'm not sure if this is gonna work for stickers. Um, organizing, I couldn't fit the sticker. And then vacuuming, I did Thursday. And Friday, we're gonna do the bathrooms. And Saturday, I have to do biodegradable dish soap for my veggie garden and dilute it with water. I gotta do it once a week. So I'm gonna put it on the calendar and then Sunday, we actually don't clean the house. Like we don't do anything extra. It's just like tidy up for the week. So I'm just gonna put this for the weekend. Maybe I'll put it here and put garden. And then Friday is clean the tub or bathroom. Maybe I'll need to trim the bubbles off this. I don't know if I'll be able to use stickers for this. This is looking a little too full. 
I don't know. Again, trying to find my planner style, like what's gonna work for me. So if you're still watching, I'm sorry this video is a thousand years long. We'll see if I can condense it more next time as I'm figuring this out. All right, so bathrooms. And for those of you that want to see, I have like a daily cleaning thing too. These are just like the bigger tasks that I try to break up with each day. See, like I can't even fit it on there. I don't know. Maybe I should not do a checklist and I could just like highlight these next time. Then that would give me a little more room. But still, this is like wide and that those ones are tall. I don't really know. I think I'm just gonna put this under. Not loving it. I don't know what we're gonna do though. Okay, so let me put this away. I still have stickers everywhere. Um, here is the look for the week. I think I really like it, except for this, it's a little crowded. I could put that sticker right over it and start over, but it's green, it doesn't really match. If it was pink, we could go for it. What's this one? It says to do. We could start over with that. Maybe I will. All right, maybe this is gonna last like a million years, but I'll just put in a screenshot of what it looks like if I'm done. All right, guys, thanks for hanging out. If you like these kinds of videos, give it a thumbs up. Let me know in the comment section below if you wanna see more videos like this. I know I'll get better as I go. Um, I'm definitely gonna do a plan with me daily duo version, so you can see that. Um, and if you wanna see more of these, I'll do them, but I really love it. I love the way this looks. All right, thanks guys, I'll see you later, bye.